everyone, the message you are about to watch is a message preached by Bishop Opu Deli Ese. This message is packed full. It's that it is anointed, it is fire right, it is loaded, and it has the capacity to put you on your throne of enthronement. I want to encourage you as you watch this message, watch it with faith in your heart, because God will impart some great measure of anointing in your life. Yokes will be broken, chains will be destroyed, walls will crumble as you watch this message. I want you to watch it with faith in your heart and trust God that every situation in your life will turn around for good in the name of Jesus. Amen. Happy New Year. Look at Luke. Chapter 13. From verse 10 to 13. I feel this day. Are you with me? Vadi Baroto Bahina. Let's read together like a mass choir. I want to go. And he was teaching in one of the synagogues on the Sabbath. Is that okay? And behold, there was a woman which had a spirit of infirmity 18 years. And was bowed together and could in no wise lift up herself. Verse 12. And when Jesus saw her, he called her to him and said unto her, Woman, thou art loose from that. If you say amen, that scripture will be fulfilled in your life. 13. Everybody want to go. And he laid his hands on her. And immediately she was met strength and glorified. 70 of you, at the sound of your amen, God will lay hands on you. Heaven will lay hands on you. Holy Ghost will lay hands on you. Leviticus 26 and verse 4. And we begin to shoot. Ratatatatata. Ekotamia. Leviticus 26 and verse 4. Are you with me? He says, Then I will give you rain in due season. And the land shall yield her increase. Say amen to that. And the trees of the field shall yield their fruit. I want you to sit down balandociously. I want to speak to us in the next 45 minutes on what I entitled the God of due season. The God of due season. I would like you to lend me your ears because the Holy Ghost is about to say something. The visitations of God travels on the wings of the speakings of God. God does nothing without his word. And he does nothing beyond his word. The word of God is the template for everlasting earth revolution. And each time God must touch man in time, he steps into his word to erase man's story by his glory. I have an understanding that the biggest way of connecting to God is to connect to the address of his word. And that is why when God wants to paint a new season for somebody, he will bring you in the tabernacle, in the glorified atmosphere of his revealed word. Friends, I want us to understand that the power of God tabernacles in the atmosphere of the world. From where we took our text, the Bible said, and Jesus was teaching in the synagogue. What is the revelation? The pronouncement of God's word, either by teaching ministry or preaching ministry, communicates the effulgence of his glory. Anywhere God sees his word, God comes himself. Follow me. Anywhere the word of God is glorified, heaven relocates to the earth to tabernacle with us everlastingly. He was not in the Bia Palosa. He was not in the PDP and APC meeting. He was in the synagogue. Synagogue could be likened to ecclesia. Ecclesia means they call out people, which another rendition called Zion. For out of Zion, the perfection of beauty, God has shined. Hey! 
arise and shine for your light has come and the glory of the Lord has risen upon you for upon my Zion there shall be a 70 of you here as you say amen bye bye to poverty I say bye bye to poverty if your amen slap the devil you are the one I'm talking about He was in the synagogue by the sanctity of the revealed world. And the revealed world is the vehicle that carries the release of the two They grow from strength to strength. Every one of them appearing before God is Zion. For out of Zion, the perfection of beauty, God has shined. For God loved the gate of Zion more than the dwelling places of Jacob. Why? Because glorious things are spoken. Glorious things. Not despicable things. Not things of low value. Glorious things. Congratulations. 70 of you by Monday morning, glorious things shall be spoken of you. Amen. Powerful things shall be spoken of you. Amen. Mighty things shall be spoken of you. Amen. If you stand up and say, Amen, you are the one I'm talking about. Amen. In the University of Science and Wonders, the cause of strategic positioning is a cause you must not fail. I will lift up my eyes. We are coming my help. My help will come from God. Hear this. There is no great man anywhere. Any man you see is a man greatly helped by God. When my father abandoned me, my sisters looked down on me. My mother, even, she's not even sure what will happen. Please take me to the rock that is higher. So in the University of Science and Wonders, the law of strategic positioning is a necessity. Where you stand determines who you see. Who you see determines what you see. What you say determines what works for you. 70 of you here, I prophesy by fire. Anything that looks like mountain in your life, as your aim has left the devil, they are coming down right now. I said they are coming down right now. I said they are coming down right now. Somebody shout my battle is over. I am giving you an exegesis of what transpired between Jesus and the recipient of the miracle of Jesus. She was in the tabernacle of his strategic presence. What is the revelation? Where you go when what happens to you happens to you matters. Oh, I salute the wisdom of that guy in Acts chapter 3. Say, friends, you've taken me to a party. There was no change. You took me to Mama Lawo. There was no change. You retired me in my bedroom to die. But God said no. But now please take me to the gate they call the beautiful gate. You are enter. See, for now we have come to Mount Zion. The assembly of the children of God. The combination of the ancient portals. I, I prophesy to 70 of you here. I don't care what is chasing you. As you say your amen, God will rewrite your history. I said God will rewrite your history. I said God will rewrite your history. Raise your hand and shout fire. Due season is a moment in time when God looks at your weakness and writes a check for you. They say you are careless, but he said she he is grace straightened. And now I command you to call. 
and to the word of his grace that is able to build you up and then give you an inheritance among them that are sanctified. The Lord said to me, as I was lying down yesterday, I said, Daddy, you know, I've got so many things to share. He said, go and tell them, due season has come. And he said to me, there are 70 persons here, strategically anointed by the law of predestination. If you are among those 70 persons, let your enemy reach as a rock and return. Responding to what I'm saying, Luke chapter 5 and verse 17 said, As Jesus was teaching and preaching, there was another thing that accompanied him that the power of God was present to heal and to deliver. In the beginning was the word. Then, how can you celebrate solution of your problem from the word that was in the beginning? Genesis chapter 1 and the word was without form and void and the spirit of God was hovering look at me the spirit can be available but until there is a romance between the spirit and the word there can be no revolution we don't only have the spirit here the word is here look at me any, if you say amen now, even the color of your skin will change. Amen. I say even oh you are looking at the God. I say the color of your skin will change. Somebody drunk and mess up. Zion on a day Shattered you, but 
at you but you are now in his presence I stand on the finished work of Jesus by the revelation of the blood of Jesus I don't know what has bent you that you cannot stop the real glory as you say amen that shame is dropping off your life that shame is dropping out of your life that shame is dropping out of your life that shame is dropping out of your life somebody shall glory Jesus notice you. I am talking about due season. Now look at the operation of due season. I'm going to give you the definition of God three for that. The Bible says, oh, show me, I think verse 13. Let me show you what God will do for you from July to December. It is not by power, neither is it by mind, but by his spirit. For it is of him that walked in you to do his will and to do of his good pleasure. Show me that look. Uh -uh, 12. Now look at this. If you penetrate into his presence, it doesn't matter the body, the vestitus of life, what men have said or what they are trying to say. You can be a victim of men's opinion. What is in you is greater than their stupidity. You are too anointed to be limited by men's expression. Now look at this. This is the season. And when Jesus saw her, it was not her that saw Jesus. I can't even remember this. Due season. Yes, sir. You know, it's a time the supernatural overshadows the natural. Yes, yes. Grace works for you yes, when labor has failed. Ah. Yes. Number one, what happened? Oh, talk to me, friend. What happened? I pray for everyone here. Between and the next one hour, Jesus will see you. Uh, I said, God will see you. Power will see you. just entered into due season and said unto her so number one is what saw her number two he called her number three said unto her what is God Jesus said to her thou art loose from that depending one thing one thing which I'm trusting God to do for everyone here 13 13 13 yes he said I he lay so there are four now. Ah. Number one is what? Oh. Number two? Oh. Number three? Seven. Number four? Lay. Child. Lay. Lift up your hands. Lift up your hands. You see those four things that brought change to that woman. If you believe in God and believe in me, as your amen reaches as a rock, every yoke in your life shall be broken. I said the yoke shall be broken. I said the yoke shall be broken. I said the yoke shall be broken. In the name of Jesus. Sit down on the heads of your enemies. Say in the due season I will send you rain. And I will impart your land and your land will hear the oil. Look at me. In God's operation, there is a season we call the due season. It's a season that God looks at you. He has mercy upon you. And he began to rewrite his name for you. 70 of you here, you will remember this service forever. Yeah. Now let's run. What is due season? Right. God's due season is a Kairos moment 
when God suspends all protocol to bless man in time. Follow me.
I believe you've been blessed by that word of enthronement that came your way. Suddenly in my heart, I believe that your life will never be the same again. In case you're out there, you don't know Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior. Quickly, I would like you to start this prayer. Say, Dear Lord Jesus. Dear Lord Jesus. I come to you. I come to you. A sinner. A sinner. I confess. I confess. From today. From today. I receive you. I receive into you. Into my life. Into my life. As my Lord. As my Lord. And personal Savior. And personal Savior. Never to sin again. Never to sin again. Congratulations. Amen. You are now sanctified, blood bought, and anointed for exploits. Amen. I want to speak specially to those who listen to the word of God. I declare by the mercies of God yes. that every yoke of limitation in your life is broken. Amen. I speak that the land where you are will not deny you your treasures. Amen. I declare when it is your time to be blessed, it will not be negotiated. Amen. I decree by the mystery of the word of God, yes. may you have access to divine inheritance. Amen. I declare healing to your body. Amen. I declare fruitfulness to everybody's situation. Amen. Receive grace for financial empowerment. Amen. Go and excel. Amen. Subdue the land. Amen. Manifest dominion. Amen. In the name of the Father. Amen. And of the Son. Amen. Amen. Thank you for watching the message of enthronement. And I believe that miracles are already happening in your life right Hallelujah. now. Hallelujah. Once I encourage you to follow us on Facebook and on other social platforms. You can see the links scrolling on your screen right now. And the headquarters of the church is located at Zion Heritage and Miracle Ministries of Voice of Nigeria Way, Lugwe Airport Road, Abuja. And we have uh, so many other branches. The branches and their addresses will also be scrolling on your screens right now. So stay connected with us and remain lifted for life.